when the interim administrator of the presidential amnesty program, retired Major General Barry Ndiomu, met with traditional rulers of the Niger Delta on the 11th of February, he revealed plans for the youth of the region. The presidential amnesty program is establishing a major cooperative entity to enable our young men and women access funds easily to develop their businesses and also to encourage entrepreneurship across the region. To prepare the youth for the empowerment program, a sensitization for the revolving loan scheme was organized in Port Hackett, the River State capital. The sensitization program for delegates was also taken to Yenagoa, the Bayelsa state capital. It's a revolving loan to empower them, to show the ex-agitators another alternative sustainable source of income other than 65,000 Naira. It's to make them entrepreneurs so that they can be employers of labor. This entire scheme is designed to help ex-agitators to be able to start something productive, and able to give them business skills, build capacity, provide access to funding for them so that they can be able to do something with labor. We understand that Niger Delta young people are productive, they want support, and we are out to provide that support for them. The cooperative scheme is good. The federal government should stand and back Indiomu up. The relevant agencies and the League of Nations should join hands with Indiomu to see that he rights the wrongs of this amnesty program because over the years the program was a serious fraud. The single-digit interest loan sensitization program also held in Benin, Edo State. Major General Barry Tarie Indiomu is a man that has come into the PAP with a clear-cut direction of what he intends to achieve. I pray that the government looks at its achievement and keeping there to sanitize the system. This is lifeline cooperative, and whatever person who embrace it, we're going to gain it. A lot of money is inside there now for them to reach out the Niger Delta youth to maintain peace in the regions. We don't need any kidnapping or stealing and all the rest. This is the only way to wipe away the, the, the criminal activities in the Niger Delta. The loan uh, initiative is a very good one because I, for one, I submitted a business plan. With this initiative, it will be an opportunity to, to showcase what I can offer. The 1.5 billion Naira Presidential Amnesty Programs Cooperative Society Limited was launched on the 24th of May this year. Of Yeteme George, Arise News. The act